before coming to truly know Christ, it was full of anxiety and I had to do everything on my own and I, I had to be perfect and never mess up and then when I did mess up, I figured, you know, might as well keep messing up because now I'm not perfect. Um, it was really dark. It was fear and doubt and shame and I didn't know what grace meant at all. I've been in church my entire life and I have known about God for my entire life. But when I came to LCC, there was scary things here. There was people that said the same thing on Sunday as they did on Thursday nights at core group and the same things on Sunday afternoon when they weren't in this building. And the decision came when hard times came and I could look to these friends and they would be beside me and they would help me through it by showing me back to God. Instead of saying, pull yourself up by your bootstraps, it was, let's pray. Or, you know, you don't need to cry about this, you don't need to be upset about this, it was, let it out, let's go to God and be okay. The people of LCC have shown me family and um, just everything about God that I never believed to be true. LCC has just changed so much. People that knew me before I came here, they don't get it. Like, what happened? Why are you so different? Why are you calmer? <laughs> I came to the Ralph's core group at a time when things were changing fast and I was going through what was a really bad time. And that first week I was here with them, I kind of gave a vague prayer request, and then afterwards I talked about it. And all of a sudden it was, what can we do? How can we stand beside you and help you through this? And for every minute of that, I had people I could text or people I could call or a house to go to where there wasn't judgment or shame or anything like that. It was just family and love. And I haven't always known that. My family is a little different than that, and the core group taught me what family really is. It's not about projecting an image, it's about being real and about being there for each other and living life together as a community and as a family. This is home to me in a way that no church ever has been, and it's not necessarily the building. You know, it's not the stained glass church I grew up in but I walk in this place and I know that the people here care and that they are a family and that I can be there for them and they can be there for me. And that no matter what happens in our lives, we can be there for each other. And most importantly, we can all go to God together.